Hello everyone and welcome back. Um, as you know that this lecture is about the innovation, its types and phases. In the previous part of this lecture, we have uh, discussed the, uh, the innovation, the different types of uh, innovation, um, and we have also discussed some uh, about the, some some test, uh, tactics and strategies of innovation um, and the benefits of innovations as well. Uh, in this part of the lecture, we will uh, talk about the uh, phases of uh, innovation. Um, so let's start with the phases of innovation. Uh, two phases of innovation we have. The first one is design phase, and the second one is implementation phase. So uh, let's um, discuss the design phase first. Design phase is marked by uh, much uh, divergent thinking and creativity, uh, brainstorming and a search for alternatives. Okay, um, yeah, uh, it may also, we can include the research uh, or a, a survey uh, for the new ideas as well. Uh, research studies suggest that the management of the design phase needs to be marked by great administrative flexibility. And uh, these types of innovation, uh, you know, to achieve the necessary uh, growth uh, to uh, survive. The implementation uh, phase uh, requires a very uh, different mode of uh, management. Um, uh, it involves putting the chosen uh, innovation um, to work. Much planning needs to be done, uh, you know, um, careful coordination, control, and evaluation of the progress and monitoring of the, uh, you know, of the different, uh, you know, uh, processes in the uh, implementation phase uh, needs to be considered. Uh, in implementation, uh, you know, uh, process of innovation include the, um, two main uh, types of innovation we will discuss here, uh, like the radical innovation and uh, incremental innovation. Uh, as I have discussed the uh, uh, differences between the radical and incremental innovation in the previous uh, uh, part of this lecture, uh, we will uh, discuss it um, again here. Um, radical innovation is you know, uh, about making major changes in something uh, established. Um, the focus is significant in relation to uh, expected changing in the system. In, in, in radical innovation, actually, uh, we uh, do uh, changes in the system. Um, uh, we do some major changes uh, in a particular system, and that change can be represent a, a radical innovation when viewed at technological level. But the impact may be only incremental when viewed at an organizational um, uh, level. Um, in radical innovation, actually, we uh, produce something new, uh, or, or uh, we try to produce something much new, uh, or in, in much new uh, form. Uh, in radical innovation, uh, actually, uh, we, we may face um, the major risks as well. Uh, and that, uh, for that, of those risks, we need to, uh, you know, um, uh, consider some uh, risk management uh, processes uh, um, uh, at the starting uh, phase of innovation. Um, incremental innovation is less um, uh, ambitious uh, in its uh, scope and offer less potential for returns for the organization.